Namaste guys, in this video we are going to learn how to make a ball joint in Solberg. So let's start. Click on here, click on new part, select a plane as per your requirement. So in my case front plane is fine, press ctrl plus 8 for normal skin to the view. Now draw a circle here, press escape, uh, drag, drag this. Uh, Okay, give it small dimension. Let's say it is 50. You can change the dimension as per your requirement. Now, I have to make it closed one. Um, escape, trim this line. Make a center line here. Escape, trim this line as well. Now, uh, let's trim this line as well. Go to the features, click on revolve for space, click on no and inc increase or decrease the thickness as per your requirement. In my case 5 is fine. Click OK. Now what you have to do is select the select this face, click on sketch, draw a circle here. Let's make it 30 mm. Go to the features, extrude reverse direction click on offset if you don't know what i'm doing just check out my free solvers course link in description and increase this value click on direction to click on up to surface select this surface click ok select this face click on sketch toy dot toy press escape exit the sketch mode now exit the addition component mode click on here new part select the front plane press ctrl plus 8 this time we will create a half uh, sphere so the radius will be what 50 mm uh, make it 25 escape select this point by pressing ctrl select this point make it ok press ctrl z select this make sure no external reference is checked on ok that's the issue so i have to delete this thing sorry i have to get a from scratch again draw the center line drag it by pressing ctrl select this two point make it one side uh, trim this line 25 to volt ball space click yes click ok select the front plane click on sketch draw a point on this part click ok exit the sketch mode select the right plane click on sketch draw a circle here of 30 mm Make sure no external reference checked on, else you will face issues. Click OK. Go to the features, extrude, uh, reverse direction. Click OK. Make sure merge result is done. Now exit the addition component mode. Right click this part. OK, this part is fixed on you. The component is fully defined by uh, notice this plane sketch is here so right click and delete it so that i can move my part you can see now i can move it now how can you make a ball joint so click on here so some people might think that concentric joint will work uh no we don't use that uh, so what i will do is click on coincident select this point and this point so this is the purpose of this joint uh, points so as you can see my ball joint is made so in that way you can make your custom ball joint as per your requirement so i hope you guys learned something from this video if you have any kind of doubts and queries feel free to ask thanks for watching and have a great day